Microphone preamps come in all sorts of types, which gives us all sorts of flavors. I prefer mixerless systems, so I could have multiple flavors of individual pre's instead of 32 channels of the same thing in a console. It could be difficult to select a preamp if you've never really had an experience with an individual high-end pre because you have no baseline to start from. A suggestion as a starting point is to either select a preamp that will be very versatile or select something that will fix your weakest link in your recording. Both options are a wise investment. For instance, the ADL 600, which is designed by Anthony DeMary Labs and distributed by Personas, is the best tube pre hands down. Normally, ADL's equipment is very expensive and runs even up to $18,000. So for two channels at $2,000, this is a steal. It is all discrete components and has Lundell transformers and is tube with a lot of headroom. You just can't go wrong with using this on any channel of a recording. This will give you not only phenomenal quality, but it will be very versatile too. If you need a channel strip, they now make the ADL 700, which has the same tube pre plus a compressor and EQ. Another example would be for voiceovers. Some voiceover artists are looking for the most intelligible sound possible. In this case, I would not select a tube pre, I would select a solid state pre. This will have more accuracies in the presence and mid-range, offering more intelligibility. However, if someone has an edgy voice, you could select a tube pre to lessen the edge. Listen to these examples and listen to the difference in the presence and mid-range. Discover what people are talking about around the state, next with Here and Now, only on Wisconsin Public Television. Discover what people are talking about around the state, next with Here and Now, only on Wisconsin Public Television. One last example would be if you are looking to get a vintage tone. In this case, a very colored preamp like the original UA610 II Pre would work. I find these pre's to be excellent, but very colored. Anything I put through it sounds like a 1970s recording to me. Over time, as you collect these different flavors, you could use them to tailor your sound in any direction at any time, which will keep your recordings exciting and allow you to explore new sounds.